I know what you're thinking. Oh my god, is Bull doing a DLC news video? Yes, yes I am, because I'm excited, and we need to talk about it, because it's amazing. Look at this cute little kitty. I am in love. I would die for them, not to be dramatic, but I would die for this little kitty. Look at his little ear tufts. Oh my goodness. Like, the, the, the quality of animals that Frontier has been putting out DLC to DLC is like chef's kiss chef's kiss was i personally excited for europe dlc no not particularly until i saw it and now it's everything i didn't know i wanted so we're gonna go over the trailer and all of the screenshots we've seen and point out some things look at this do you see this do you see this down here i think we are getting new decals and i am here for it so much i'll show you a couple other places where we see them and the amount of excitement that it stirs in my soul is is Oh my gosh, this building pack is going to be amazing. You just watch, just wait. Oh, oh, I'm so excited to get a hold of it. Um, this is new, this wall down here, but I actually think that if it's not a full wall set, it might be a decal. Um, and I'll show you why in another picture. Um, this, I don't know if this is a ride. I've seen lots of people saying it's maybe just a scenic priest or a ride, but I think they're definitely like getting on this so whether or not it's a ride or it's just like a little shop shell thing um is also possible because we also have these we have these food truck things as shop shells and i'm thinking that maybe that this is what this is um and then also you get to see back in here the little burrow uh, that we're gonna have which is super cute and i'm very excited for um and I love the neon signs that we're getting. Like this pack, I tell you what. And this, this fence, this fence right here is everything I've ever wanted in my life. I tell you what. It is so just generic zoo. And we all know that I am obsessed with the idea of just getting generic zoo items in this zoo game. That is all I've ever wanted. And I'm so, so pumped for it. Um, some other little things like these little black trim pieces I believe are new um, and I just see them being super useful to be honest um, the rest of this looks like just the classical set stuff I'm sure there is new things in there um, these shutter windows are new or at least the shutters I don't know if they're separate I really hope that they're separate um, I don't think that's custom made I think that is a piece because we see it quite a bit through here and Frontier is usually not very piece heavy um, with their builds. Um, this cantilever bridge is amazing. I'm assuming it's just a scenery piece, but even still it's amazing. If it's functional, even better, but it's probably just a scenery piece. Um, I love these lights. I love them so much. We see them in the trailer too. They're beautiful. We get a peek at what the new shop counters look like. Um, they seem really useful. I think we'll be able to use them in a lot of really creative ways. I'm gonna, they're gonna be everywhere in Dunham Park. I'll tell you that right now. Um, these medieval banner things are also amazing. I love them. They kind of fit with the, uh, Arctic ones that we got. Um, I wish we, we got, when we got stuff like this, I wish we got it for more animals that were already in the game, but you know, beggars can be choosers. Um, this stained glass piece with the Ibex is incredible. Now this is what I'm talking about when I'm saying, I think that this stone texture is a decal because look at this little piece here. I think this is decals. I think these are decals and that is amazing and I am here for it. Um, same with this triangle piece might be new but it might just be um the stone piece rotated and i'm looking too much into it uh, which is probably possible i'm not sure if this is a new path or if this is the path we already have um but yeah they look amazing these screenshots look incredible i'm very excited this is the new um scenario map this is new i i believe um if the if it's not a new wall set then these again might be decals here these kind of indented windows um i would prefer if the indented windows aren't a decal but again beggars can't be choosers this map looks amazing um yeah not too much in there i don't really use the ride so that doesn't really interest me a whole lot but and then we got the Ibex. He looks very, very cute. A little more stylized than the Lynx, but still very cute. The babies are life, and I love them. Um, they're so great. They would be good as like a little, if you don't want to use mods and you want to do a petting zoo, these baby Ibex are goats. They are the perfect petting zoo goats. 
even the females are pretty good um, so if you don't want to use uh, mods and you want to do a petting zoo that's what I would use because they're adorable all right and now we're gonna watch the trailer together so first off the lots of new stuff we're seeing this bridge is new um, I believe uh, and I'm assuming they just have path laid in here and the bridges aren't functional, but there is, if you look, there is a guest walking across that bridge. So whether they've just laid in the path or not. Again here, this boat, uh, I don't see it being a ride. Maybe, but I think it might just be a shop shell like the food trucks we see. There is some guests here, so they're obviously going in and out of this boat. And here we see the loading ramp for this boat with a path connected to it. So they're definitely going in the boat. I, I'm just not sure why they're going in the boat. We see this great railing again, um, which makes me think that this is a new path and this is the railing for that path. Um, it's beautiful. I love it. Um, if it's not new, I'm sad that I didn't notice it before. <laughs> um, again, we have this great stone texture. Maybe it is a wall set and we have decals to go along with it, which would be ideal. Um, these shutters again in a different color. They're awesome. These pennants like banners are amazing. I love them. I don't think we have them in game. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they're new. I love them. There is so much in this trailer. Now this could be a ride and it's just the ankle. But you see these wires in the background that look like telephone or electric wires? If this is a new piece, my mind is going to explode. You also see it here. Okay, my tiny little head will explode if we get a little wire piece like that. Like that is, it seems so silly, but it is game changing. I'm telling you right now it would be game changing. Bikes, these great neon signs. I'm in love with these. I'm gonna use them everywhere. Um, this bracket piece again is great. I love it. Um, and if these are pieces that are already in the game, please tell me because I'm gonna start using them right now. Um, but I think that they're new and I love them. Uh, these signs that they made <laughs> for all the Europe animals, I, they're so cheesy zoo. I am in love with them. I love them so much. I'm here for them. Yes, I wish, I, again, I just wish when they gave us this stuff that they gave us for a few of the animals we already have um, because they're amazing. I love them. I love this castle in the background. It's also pretty great. They might have some new pieces on there. Um, I don't know, it seems like maybe we get pieces in the update because it seems like there's a lot of new pieces for it only being a 250 pack um but yeah i'm, I'm interested to see um what all we get it's going to be very exciting i think that with the pieces that i've seen if they're new what i'm seeing in this trailer if if all these pieces are new pieces i think it's going to hold the attention of the community a lot longer than the last few packs which i'm very excited about because the 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 drought of content is affecting my mental health to the point where i've started streaming and you all have to put up with me like ooh we need to end that all right so here we actually get to see if you can see him we actually get to see the little badger in here oh he's so cute i don't know why he has such a big habitat but frontier get a frontier um let's see if we can see him again i didn't go back far enough He's really cute. I'm weirdly excited for this little badger. I tell you what, I, I just, I feel like the short little dumpy animals make zoos. And I am here for any time that we get new short little dumpy animals. You know, like the animals that most people don't even look at. Those are like my favorite parts of the zoo. Um, because I'm a short dumpy animal and I relate to them. Uh, we see the food truck shell thing over here again. Um, Pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna use those a ton in Dunham Park because, uh, you know, food trucks are life. Uh, this path again, great. I think it is new. Um, the railing is amazing. I hope it's recolorable, we'll see. Um, but yeah, if we could recolor this black, oh, oh my God, so good. I would love, it's not gonna happen. We all know it's not gonna happen, but I would love if the post and the rail were separate. It's not gonna happen, but a girl can dream. 
All right, um, again, these shutter windows, pretty great. I think that the shutters are separate, you know, which gives me hope. Um, I think most of this is just set stuff we already have. Um, but yeah, we do see the badger in the food truck in this scene. Um, we get this great bridge with the lights. Oh, so nice. I think that these lights, I think we have lights like this, but I'm not sure if these um, are like a separate uh, piece we don't have yet or not. I know we do have string lights like this, so that's that could be wrong. This great stone texture again. Um, these, I hope these are algae decals. I will lose my shit, I'm telling you right now. Oh my god, I, I can't even tell you. If these are decals of algae, oh my god, oh my god. I mean, these could all be billboards, but it's Frontier, so I doubt it. <laughs> um, this bridge is great. It's going to be all one piece. We all know it, but it would be great if we got all these pieces separate, like this chain and this thing. But it's not. It's going to be all one piece, which is fine, too. It's very pretty. Um, I don't really... Maybe I'll have to make it a European uh, zoo so that I can use it. Again, we see these great little signs. I love them. I think they're great. Were these, like, banner type things, these pennant things? Those are great. I love these. Again, these like medieval type banners, I love them. I, I just wish when they gave us this stuff that we'd get it for more than just that pack. I know why they do that, it makes sense. I just, I wish in my heart we got them for more. And maybe we'll get like, you know, Nick and Leaf will mod us some different animals on there, um, but it'd be great. It would be all, the ultimate thing would be as if these were billboards. Frontier, if you're listening ever, for some reason you have stumbled across my tiny corner of the internet. If you could give us things like shaped like this that were billboards, I would love you forever. You would be my hero forever. Okay. Oh, oh, and then it lights up. It lights up. It's so good. <laughs> These little badger things are life. I, oh my God, I love them. I love them so much. We get a close up of the fire salamander one. Oh, chef's kiss, so good. Maybe this is a wall set because we do see it in here. Um, these, I don't know, do we have this piece here? Because these are amazing and the Christmas builds that are gonna come out after this pack are gonna be next level. I'm excited for the Estan Christmas Village that will inevitably be happening. Um, so, so, so good. I haven't noticed any of the new f um, foliage. I know we're getting new foliage, but I haven't noticed any, um, but I could be wrong. Um, yeah. <laughs> So here again, we see the food truck. Um, we see the regular deer statue. I hope we get a fallow deer statue because we are getting a fallow deer with this um, pack. Um, yeah, these Christmas trees, I think are the ones we already have in game. I could be wrong. Uh, these little market stalls are super, super, super cute. Um, I don't know if this awning, like top 10 pieces, one piece, or if that's they've made that um, custom you see another this this great ibex um stained glass is so good i love it i don't know what this is on the top here but that's kind of cool uh yeah lots of cool stuff happening these this build is so intricate like i hope this is the build that we get to play in because it's it's really pretty it's really well done i like it a lot so i hope we get to play in it i that would be exciting for me Oh, and then it lights up. And then it lights up. <laughs> so pretty. The lighting in this game is so good. It's so good. I wish I played at night, <laughs> but I don't. Because <laughs> I don't actually play this game. These little shield things are great. I love them. I love the medieval vibe. Like, I'm, am I going to make a medieval village? Probably. Because this is everything. We see this fake piece here again. This is definitely a decal. And I'm very excited for it. Do we have this piece in game? And I've been obsessing over this piece that we already have. Let me know. Let me know. Be like, Bold, you're stupid. We already have that. Um, and if we don't, I'm excited to get it. Um, again, these market stalls are going to be great. These little counters. I'm I'm really excited. I mean, the food ones are exciting in themselves, but I'm really excited for later on um, if and when we get um, like the gift shop versions of these and the information booth um, versions of these. I think that'll be so, so, so much more useful. And I hope when we get the gift shop ones that they give us um, gift shop items to go with so that we can make interior gift shop items that aren't 10 million pieces. Um, but I digress. Ah, oh, then we get to see the lights. 
oh my god she is so pretty just like oh my god the way the moonlight hits her it's Lumi. look at her look at her ear tufts she's amazing she's amazing she's so cute i'm excited to have this small of a cat in the game and i'm excited that it's not another canine because enough we have enough okay let let another phylum or whatever you call it take over okay <laughs> no more bears no more canines you heard it here <laughs> unless it's a sloth bear in which i will allow it oh look at her oh, she's so pretty and she does this little this little this little mouth lick oh my god oh my god i love her i love her look at her oh so cute so cute i think she's gonna go i'm gonna replace the um palace cats in Dunham Park, possibly with this Lynx. Or maybe she'll get her own outrageously done up exhibit because she's beautiful and I love her. So yeah, that's the pack. Um, we are getting with it, if you didn't know, the Eurasian Lynx, Alpine Ibex, European Badger, and European Fallow Deer. And the new exhibit animal, the Fire Salamander. Ooh so cute salamander cute i hope it's like a temperate box that would be super cool i would have loved if we could have gotten um like a mammal in an exhibit box <sighs> like a tiny tiny mammal would have been cool but i'll take a fire salamander because they're adorable and it's going to be adorable and i'm very excited for it um the burrows i'm very excited for this whole th update and pack i'm very excited for i hope you're excited let me know how you feel about it down below um and i will see you when we i guess get to see more of the animals uh thanks for hanging out i hope you're excited and i'll see you next time Bye bye hey you know it'd be really cool if you went ahead and hit that subscribe button 